How do you keep the passion going, burning in your marriage for one another when, man, there's just so much pressure around raising your children? Well, that's a great question. And, and I think when you think about the stage and phase that we're in with high schoolers and college students, you have to be more strategic to keep the passion. When they're toddlers, you don't have to be as strategic. You know, you can take, go take a nap, right? You know, um, but... but <laughs> Wait, wait a minute. I don't know if you could go take a nap. I have two toddlers, but I hear you. I'm, I'm going with you. Yeah, all right. you know, watch the movie, right? That, there you go. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> but you, when you got all this activity going on, you have to be strategic. And so I say flirting, dating, and strategic mm. encounters, right? And so we flirt a lot verbally and physically, but you have to be kind of undercover with it. And a couple of ways to be really undercover is to use food and sports. So I may say, Christine, could you scramble some eggs? <laughs> you know, um, did you put extra butter on the potatoes? You know, and I'll, you know, she'll catch it. She didn't used to play along with me, but now she'll go back and forth with me. And so, what, what do your kids say when you do that? Are they picking up on it, or is it still like? We think they're not picking up on it. I never asked. So. <laughs> I never asked. That's probably good. I would definitely say they're picking up on it. At, to the point where they ask us to stop and we don't. We just remind them that that's why they're here. Um, another thing that we do is we love music. Uh, Calvin loves Anita Baker, so I know whenever he puts it on, it's when he's trying to get extra romantic. Uh -huh. And then, you know, that's true, right? And the Anita Baker thing was an issue in our house, so I didn't know which way this was gonna go when she <laughs> mentioned Anita, but that is part of the setup is a little Anita. But you have some flirting throughout the day, and we'll date between uh, activities. Uh, maybe we take the kid to cheerleading as a two-hour practice. We'll, we'll go get a bite to eat and have conversation and hold each other's hands, look into each other's eyes. And, you know, I'm setting the stage for, you know, to put Anita Baker on, right? And so, <laughs> you, so we try to build that throughout our day, and we just try to do it in an innovative way. So that's what I would encourage people to do. Thank you for that. I don't want to let the cat out of the bag, but I think the Snyders used the word budget. <laughs> Is that true? <laughs> That's right. Do you need to balance the budget? That's a word that you can use there. Yeah. Very practical. I like it.